this is a generic adventure RPG world with Jack Black. You actually had one job, one singular job, and you somehow managed to fuck it up. Okay, um, hi everyone, and uh, yeah, first up I'm just gonna say that if my voice sounds awful, I literally just woke up, but holy crap, I need to talk about this because I am like losing my goddamn mind over this fucking llama. So, I know the joke of, oh, Minecraft shouldn't be round is kind of a joke at this point, but like, really, they made the, they made the game rounded. And I know that sounds like an incredibly stupid criticism, but Minecraft is a very old game at this point, and its style is both very unique and very nostalgic to millions of players. That's why, like, half the community lost their mind when they decided to change the default textures. If you show this to someone, they know it's Minecraft. They know it's a Minecraft arrow. Meanwhile, in the Minecraft movie, that is just a regular fucking arrow. It's like, yeah, it has, like, the little cubey parts on, like, the end of it, but it's, like, it's still a cube, like, little kind of thing on the end of a round arrow. Not to mention the fact that it looks nothing like an actual Minecraft arrow. I can go to fucking Walmart right now, walk into the toy aisle, and buy a perfectly accurate toy Minecraft bow and arrow with an accurate arrow to the game. How does Walmart outdo a million dollar movie? Minecraft as a game can be absolutely beautiful and breathtaking at some times, but this, this is not Minecraft. Minecraft can be made to look incredibly realistic with very realistic looking shaders and texture packs. But do you know what all those texture packs and shaders can't do? They can't change the fundamental shape of a cube. I've made many things over the years, from animations to maps to just whatever I wanted to. Because that's the point of the game, is to create. And by limiting the player to a cube-like environment, you promote creativity by limiting what you can do. You have to choose, and you have to pick, what you use to make your world. They cheated. They did not bind themselves to the same limitations the Minecraft player base has been facing since day one. It's a cube world. This is not Minecraft. This is a generic adventure RPG world with Jack Black. And on the note of Jack Black, I want to talk about the acting, because frankly, I have no problem with them randomly isekaiing Jack Black into Minecraft. The obvious problem being that this is just not Minecraft, and they didn't make everything cues. Which again, sounds stupid coming out of my mouth right now, but again, as I've explained, you can make cubes look absolutely beautiful. These are not cubes they used. Alright, editing Nar here. I realized after I recorded this entire video, I did not address the fact that the llama has a realistic looking mouth. Somehow I just forgot to mention that, even though it was bugging me the entire time. Why the fuck does the llama have a realistic looking mouth? But the last thing I want to discuss is the actual story, because we didn't get pretty much anything as to what this movie is going to be about. What we did get, though, is a lot of negativity. And while I know I just spent the past, like, few minutes completely shitting on this movie, I honestly don't know why Hollywood movies have to diss and just make fun of everything. Why can't we just take something at face value and accept that it's weird, and it's crazy, and it's fun? Specifically, I want to talk about this line here. Who are you? I am Steve. <sighs> okay. Oh, this guy is such a tool bag. Just why? Why? Like, like, actually why? Why do we have to insult Steve and be like, oh, yes, he's such a tool, oh no, Jason Momoa sighs depressingly. Why can't we just accept the fact that, oh, wow, you know, funny man with pickaxe, go Brie. Like, the reason I bring this up is that in recent years, Hollywood seems to basically make it their one-track goal to remake anything they possibly can, but whenever it's remade, it's remade with nothing but just pure salt and they seem to always just dish whatever it is they actually make. Obvious examples being the Resident Evil show, uh, I guess, the Acolyte, I guess, holy crap, that series was a disaster. Like, why can't we just make a show that respects the actual, like, source material for once? You can make it the most creative thing to ever exist, you can change it, you can add your own things. But if you start disrespecting the original property, it's going to just be a disaster from that point on, and there will be no saving it, unless you have a really good marketing team. But either way, yeah, this is just a bunch of garbage. 
Minecraft is a cube game. It's weird. It's wacky. It's fun. And it's the game we all grew up loving. And it's the game many of us continue to love to this day. With that said and done, uh, I'm going to end this here. Otherwise, this will be a two-hour video of me losing my goddamn mind. I also want to clarify here that I actually love Jack Black. I think most of his movies are amazing. And I do believe he actually does very much like Minecraft from what he's like shown in the past. So yeah, I don't hold anything actually against the actors in this movie. It honestly, from everything we've seen, especially the part of everyone shooting on Steve, that's not an actor's choice, that's the writer's choice. And whoever wrote this movie, I can already tell, doesn't like the game. Which is good, since this is not the game. This is a round, weird, like, this looks more like The Sims than it does Minecraft. But either way, I hope you enjoyed this rant video. I will see all of you next time. Have a great morning, a great evening, and a great existence. And yeah. Oh my god, I have lost all faith in Hollywood.